Good morning, ladies and gents. Check this out. Three weapons out for a tour, and we're going to be spending the day with these two reprobates. Bulldog Gaz, the likeable rider, and uh, Zaraland. It looks better out there, I promise. But um, just as soon as we get our intercoms connected. Intercom faff, go! That might help. Yeah. Tell you what, I'll turn mine on. Something connected. I'm not hearing you, Andy. Oh, something worked. Shit the bed. Holy bollocks. Oh, it's cut off. What's happened there? Oh, I can't eat. You're all completely garbled now. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, not now. We've still got the... But what I heard was... Oh, how am I supposed to get on this now? So you not bring your stepladder? Ah, oh, I've ripped me gusset. <laughs> right, are we ready? Who's leading this rabble? i got to do it. Oh, damn. All on board. Oh, a tunnel. Oh, dear. Proper nippy in here, oh, Jesus! <laughs> we please get back in the sun. Hang on a minute. Why is the sun not turning to turn round? Oh, this is going well already. On the road for two minutes, I'm already lost. Well, it's, we're going the right way, but it's, it seems to be backwards. What is that all about? Well, I'll just follow it. Well, <laughs> it. oh, it's actually nice and breezy. I would say for me in my super duper mega summer wear that this is borderline too cold. Oh yeah, <laughs> you've got your uh, thin vest on. Hey, I feel like an extra in a take that video from the 90s. <laughs> I can hear, hardly hear Sean, he's really like, quiet. Yeah, I can't really hear you either, very crackly. I can hear you too. Yeah. Yeah, it's because we're practically touching each other. <laughs> well not again, you had that all night. The quality is a bit lackluster isn't it? I mean, I can hear you now pretty good, but I can imagine when we get up to some higher speeds, it's going to be rubbish. To me, you sound like in the sci-fi films when they send the deep space distress signal. Yeah, so 30k is providing the central hub facilities connected to a Cardo Pactorp bolt at the front, and I've got the 10 c Evo in here. We should say it took us about three hours to get it all working, and we were up to like one in the morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there, there was a little bit of stress involved. We're in. Right, I'm going to give it the pasty. Boys, we're off. Holy shit, it's cold. <laughs> this comms is friggin' terrible, isn't it? I'm receiving a deep space transmission. Someone needs our help. I don't know whether he's telling us that there's an alien, we should go in, or if we should pick up coffee. Is Gaz still there or is he gone? No, I'm still here. I can't hear you very well. Or maybe I'm just a deaf old man. You what? I'm just a deaf cold man. It is cold. Oh, it's a bunch of whingers. Whinging yesterday about how it was too hot, now it's too cold. Yeah, why do I even ride a bike? I don't like it. Is the number plate still on? What number plate? Oh no, I lost my number plate yesterday, folks. Went over a big bump and then it flew off. Andy came to my rescue and rescued it out of the hedge. <laughs> well, yeah, now we're on the road. This is the, the first group outing, the first time I've actually seen Sean's beautiful new steed. Oh. The lovely KTM Super Duke R. Ah, get a good look as he goes around this bend here. Oh, I said bend. She got a lovely R end. She has got a lovely back end. And then Gaz is behind us on his also relatively new Triumph 800 Tiger XC, which ironically, being the smallest engine of the group, is by far and away the loudest bike of the team. <laughs> <laughs> I have actually ripped my gusset getting on my bike. Really? Well, imagine what's going to happen to your knackers if you were to have an off. Oh yeah, to be fair, it's having to deal with a fairly uh, monstrosity of a package. <laughs> the substantial <laughs> payload. <laughs> But this road's pretty shagged. Uh, shagged as your gusset, mate. If you could just run alongside me, just hold on to my number plate <laughs> as we drive around. Well, now it's warm. Moan, moan, moan. Jesus, you can take the boy out of Britain, but you can't take the British out of the boy. Uh, 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 my vagina hurts. <laughs> <laughs> so my adjusted handlebar situation feels marginally better, but it feels like I'm riding a supermoto now. Have you tipped him forward? Or? Yeah, it does mean that my indicator button is now pretty much pointing at my chin. Because I've got new problems now. Now when I want to change the, the rider mode, I'm going to hit the horn instead. So whatever I do, the horn is always the button that gets pushed. I've always got the horn. Haven't we all? Well, you better rein it in today. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to be building any trouser tents with a hole in your gusset. It could be very embarrassing. Oh, what views? Oh, starting with the views already. Look at that. Oh, 
some holes there, Jesus. Oh, bloody hell, that was a big hole. Are you there? Hi, oh, we're there. <laughs> oh, I thought you'd gone. We're hearing you through the subspace channels, but there's a lot of interference from the Tetrion field. What a geek, Jesus. Say what? We're going to have to repolarize the front deflector array. How have you got all that nonsense in your head? I don't know, mate. I honestly don't know. <laughs> if I could replace it with something useful that could give me some sort of meaningful earning potential, years wasted on sci-fi. This town looks somehow like it should be by the seaside. Didn't get any of that. Well, this is the most tossiest intercom I've ever had. All I'm getting is... Yeah, that's what I said. Very cool. I uh, didn't get that. Very cool. We're receiving a transmission from the Decepticons. Bop, bop, bop. Wop. Hey, it's Dudinghausen. All right. Oh, it's a good bit of road here, boys. Twisty. Country lane. Oh, oh. oh, beautiful surfaces. Oh, how come I hit all the bloody bumps? Because there aren't any not bumps. Oh, back in Imel Rod again. The Elven Prince. Jesus, I'm such a f geek today. I can't wait till we get back to our apartment and play some World of Warcraft tonight, though. Oh, hang on, we were going to do Space Hulk tonight, weren't we? I was just going to drink beer until I get a nosebleed. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good to me. Let's do that. Let's all drink beer until you get a nosebleed. <laughs> Gaz or not? Yeah, sure, that'd be a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think we need to pre prefix. No, it's afterwards now, so it's a suffix. Suffix this section of video by saying that all of the comms just sound utterly garbled and nonsense. So even though when we swap footage, it's all going to sound super clear. It's going to make most of the jokes and the miscommunications not that funny, isn't it? Because this is all going to be really comprehensible. Com comprendable? Com compre comprehendable. That's not a word, Andy. That is not a word. Well, it should be comprehendable. Sounds a bit biological, though, doesn't it? Oh, I've got a terrible infection in my comprehendable.
that's not that full. Well, there's a market on, you can get yourself a new belt and a handbag and maybe a straw hat. Oh, they've read my mind. I was thinking that the one thing that's missing from my get up today is a straw hat. Maybe a Stars and Stripes bandana. Time for teas and pastries. I want to be closer to you. I mean the KTM, Sean, not you. Sorry, mate. No apologies needed. Yep, if you're going to hang around with such a hottie. Though, Gaz, I don't mean you. Oh, I thought you were oh, God. Oh, well, there we go. We are breakfasted. I've just had a nice piece of dessert for breakfast, so later on I'll have a sausage for dessert. That's what she said. Hey, so update to the Senna 10C Evo Group Intercom nonsense. It seems like the problem lies with the 30K. The 10C Evo is now providing the, the hub for the thing and the audio quality is considerably better. Yep. Although in defense of the Senna, it could be because like we already said, the, uh, the Sony X3000 does give out constant Bluetooth interference. Don't know, but yeah, I think it's a lot better. We say something, lads. Hello. 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 Yeah, yeah. Hi, hi there. I think you being in the middle as well helps. If Gaz is at the rear, going rear tango, then uh, makes it a bit more difficult, doesn't it? Yeah, of course. I suppose his transmissions are going through me. Everybody likes to go through AMC. But yeah, so there we go. Back to the riding. There are all four blinkers, Sean. What is going on here? I think your bike's having a shit. It is having a shit. Electronics are... Oh, hang on, there's oil pissing out all over the floor as well. <laughs> Are you joking? <laughs> <laughs> this me number plate on. Where well, it's on, it's covered in oil. <laughs> you guys ever been here to Villingen? This is where everybody comes for their like um, stag do's, hen do's. It's just a pissed up town. Uh, on the weekend and in summer, this place is just rammed with party goers. It's literally just the Ibiza of uh, Zauerland. Yeah, this is the place to be if you want to go mental. Get lagered up and puke on your girlfriend. <laughs> Sorry. Yep, this first first stag do. They're already absolutely rubbered. It's five to eleven in the morning. Yeah, they're probably yeah, still yeah. rosa from last night. Well, hopefully nobody's going to get rosa today. Ah, uh, we're behaving ourselves. Is the pace all right, or is it too slow? Way too fast. I've got a Honda now. <laughs> Bad Oops. Oh dear. We're going to get any visitors at Bigazi. Well, I guess there's maybe one or two. Well, we're definitely not going to make it there for 12 o'clock. Probably not even half 12. Well, we said 12 ish. Should probably explain that actually. We'd originally planned this whole thing as a bit of a subscriber meetup for the three of us in Germany because the one last year was pretty successful, even though I didn't manage to make it there. <laughs> That's why it was so successful. Well, hey, what's your. Right, I'm going home. <laughs> well, did you see that bouncing down the road, Gaz? That was my teddy. <laughs> With the pram. Forget the pram! <laughs> yeah, anyway, we were going to do a subscriber meetup. Yeah, trying to be professional here, honestly. Never work with children and animals. Or shag them. Oh Defin dear, it's definitely Sorry. not that bloody hell. <laughs> <laughs> this just took a very different flavour. Oh, that was, that was wrong. Sorry, Andy, carry on. Well, oh, I don't know if I can. Uh, yeah, but obviously the C word happened and everything got a bit crazy with groups and crowds and all this kind of stuff. So, uh, yeah, we left it for ages and then everything kind of went back sort of to normal. But it looks like in Germany things are going south here again. So we kind of decided actually not to hugely publicise the meet because uh, we thought that maybe building a crowd of people in a car park that are all going to sweat on each other probably wasn't the most responsible thing to do. And as so, we yeah. are so responsible. Absolutely, we thought we would do the good thing and uh, just enjoy the riding to ourselves. So sorry about that, everybody. Sodges. have lovely churches here. Not that I'm a church goer or anything, but... Yeah, I'm not much of a church goer either, but I do appreciate a good church. There was a time when Charlotte was my favourite. <laughs> <laughs> 
You literally could ride around here forever, couldn't you? It's just so stunning. It's so big. Yeah, I reckon there's so much of it that you would take years to cover everything. Yeah. Challenge accepted. Waving around corners is a bit dodgy, you need to hit your hand. <laughs> I was going for the high five. Oh, okay. That could be a bit painful. Not with my Nox Handroid, it wouldn't. Destroy his our whole arm. Pow! Yeah, that's a bit over aggressive. I'm sorry, I'll take that, I'll take that back. <laughs> Loving the old slipper clutch in this as well. Less scared to do a downshift on a corner. I was already cranked over with the downshift then. I've been an, an advocate for purist riding for so long, but I'm actually kind of loving the technology a little bit. You can be a bit more of a dick and still get away with it. Everybody loves a bit more dick. <laughs> Noisy, aren't they? Ooh. Oh, boys, I'm enjoying this immensely. Yeah, this is proper good. It's a good looking three chaps over there on the window. No, but one of them's got a really sexy bike. Oh, that one with all the aluminium on it. I just saw myself in the window and nearly had a wet dream. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've nailed it when you can, can constantly look at your bike and just think yes. Yeah, absolutely. For the win. Yeah, I've 100% had that reaction with this bike since I've got it. And if it rides good as well, then that's a bit of a bonus. Yeah, that helps. Right, we've got a few k's now of just forest. Look at that view. Yeah, I know. It's a good looking bike, isn't it? Oh, you mean that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> little bit. Well it's good while it lasted. Use 
closing all the road there, mate. That was brilliant. Oh, that was absolutely special. Well, that crash bars are well placed. You can ride it like a Harley. <laughs> oh, how good is that? Luckily, it doesn't look at all silly either. I look proper cool, right? Yeah. <laughs> That is a weird roundabout. That makes no sense. That's strange, isn't it? Right, right, right. Oh, yes. Oh, Just what we needed now. That is the good shit. Who are you wearing, you man, Cam? No, he's that British tosser. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's got an FZ1, hasn't he? Well, it's funny feeling I've been on this road before. Is it possible we came this way yesterday? No. No, I don't think we did. It just all looks the same. Zoeland is so boring. Too many bloody corners when you ask me. I'm glad to get about it back to Hamble, use the middle of my tyre. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very good. Oh, I need some air in the suit. You get your arm in the right place, it gushes up the up your arm and out, out your back. Delightful. That is exactly what she said. If someone pointed an infrared camera at us now, I think it would explode. Oh, look at that. Look at those bastards in the water. Oh, you will look so fresh. It's fresh and so clean. You just dive off now. So every other normal person is taking the family down to the sea, they're on the beach, they're in the water. What are we doing? We're we strapped on our pervert suits and rode around on our heat machines. What's that you say? 35 degrees? I think I'll go and ride a radiator around and cook me testicles a bit while wearing a plastic bag. I'll tell you what, to make it all better, I'll stick a bowl on my head. It's not that full. No. Right then, well this is it. The big as E. Get some grub and uh, we'll see you afterwards. <laughs> Oh, well there we go ladies and gents, that was the hottest lunch the world has ever known. It is hotter than Beelzebub's ball sack inside of everything I own, but nice enjoyable plate of chips with a nice non-alcoholic wheat beer, lovely stuff. But we are going to go and smash some more bendies. It's been belting so far, but Sean has been absolutely smashing the back doors out of the routing today. So we're looking forward to more of that please Sean. Okay, I'll do me best. Thank you Bigger Grill, goodbye, till next time. Let me get some air conditioning. Oh god, it says 37 degrees an hour mine. The thermometer in my pants says 400. <laughs> <laughs> I think this has got to be the hottest ride I've ever done. Hot because it's so sexy. Oh, it does look quite refreshing, doesn't it? Everybody's off panel boating. Everyone's off panel beating. Everybody was panel beating. What? Good job. <laughs> like a crack, base cold. Dun 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 dun. I am overjoyed how good these roads are. Overcooked that, bloody hell. Oh, that one's got tight. Yeah, I got caught up by that one, big time. Well, I'm gonna go out and say it, this is, this is the best ride I've had out in Zalvan. Wow, that's a big one. It's just been endless mega roads. Well then, 
boys and girls, it looks like this is the end of the day for us. We are literally on the last 20 kilometers before we reach Winterberg for our resting place for the last night of this little trip. So massive thanks to the likable rider, to Bulldog Gaz. If you haven't seen any of their videos, do check them out. Particularly watch out for this video that they'll be making of this insane day that we've just had in Zoeland. So if you've enjoyed the video, give it a big fat thumbs up. If you've hated the crap out of it, thumbs down it to death. If you're not already, get yourself subscribed to the channel as well. Tick the little bell to make sure you don't miss out on anything in the future. And yeah, just watch out for all of the upcoming videos yet to come of me smashing this beautiful CV1000R around the countryside here in Germany and hopefully somewhere else as well. So it's goodbye from me, it's goodbye from Bulldog Gaz, and it's goodbye from the likable rider. Hello. See you next time. Ta-ra! Winterberg. See you next time, everybody. Goodbye. So oh, Andy's having a problem with the technique once again. Oh, I heard a beep. Oh, are you doing it? <laughs> MC's having a douche. He's having a shower. Oh my god. Have you took the old bottle in there? Can you fire some of your juice at me back? I've got a sex drum. <laughs> <laughs>